Welcome back to Club Risky Business. Our story begins with David, a married man with a few extra hot side plates. I know what you're thinking. This is Zambia. There's nothing new about this story. That's the way it's been, that's the way it is, and unless we do something about it, that's the way it will be. Besides, isn't that what they say makes a man? The number of women he has. But is that what really makes a man? Hello, my sweetheart. Hi, how are you? You know how it is. I need to see you. Okay. Basically, I... <laughs> I don't I don't understand. Listen, let me get back to you on that one, eh? Sheila, what's going on? We've been uh, planning this trip for months. It's my husband. Imagine, he's forbidden me to go. But didn't you tell him? This is a business trip. Does he suspect something? He made a big deal out of it. Who knows? He really wants to act like an angel. Angel. <laughs> As if I don't know what he's up to. I'm so sick of this. You know what? To hell with him. Let's just go. Let's just take the no, 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 no. There will be other opportunities. Don't worry. We need to be very careful. Yeah, I know. Amazing how a woman I've never even met is the only person who understands me. Hey baby! You came? You know I always do. Hmm. So how are things? Mm, okay. I thought it would be a bit better if you could get me this phone. <laughs> Another phone? Why do you need two phones? You have two phones? Mm, I'm in business and you're at college. But this one is not charging anymore. Get another battery. Ish. I'm sorry I brought it up. <sighs> okay. Let me see what I can do about it. Aww, you're always so nice to me, baby. So, would you like to come out for a bit? You know, and go for some drinks. The usual place. Have some food, you know. Not tonight. I have this important assignment that's due tomorrow and... But I promise I'll make it up to you. You know, it's school, but you know I would rather be with you, right? Okay, no problem. Okay. See you later. Bye. See you. What up, baby? What up, baby? What's up? We'll party at tonight. Man, you know how I do, man. What time? How you doing? That fresh is so clean for you. Uh -huh. Damn, you look tired. Where are we going? Hurry, yeah, hurry. Don't worry, man. I got a scrub, man. There's a new job in town, baby. So, David's the man, eh? A real tycoon? Any smart businessman knows it pays to diversify your investments. And he's got investments everywhere. Sheila, Maria, Mimi, investments of time and money. 
But besides the obvious, what other returns is he getting on these investments? Hidden returns on his secret investments. Each of David's side plates has other partners and so on. David is entangled in a vast network or web of sexual relationships and he doesn't even know it. And when someone in that network becomes infected with HIV, it puts everyone at high risk. David is only searching for physical and emotional satisfaction. And when he doesn't find it in one place, he goes looking for it somewhere else. At any cost. Oh yes, there is got investments everywhere. Except the one place is really profitable. 